WordPress plugins are small pieces of software that can be added to your WordPress site to extend what the site can do. There are plugins for almost everything, from social media sharing, to improving the security of your site, to giving you data about how many people visit your site, and search engine optimization. When choosing a plugin, it's best to check if it's compatible with the latest version of WordPress, and if it's been updated recently. Also, what rating does it have? An out-of-date or poor quality plugin could cause problems with your site, so it's best to check. To find out which plugins are currently installed on your site, from the dashboard, go to Plugins and Install Plugins. And you can see the plugins that we have installed on this particular site. The blue ones are active and the white ones are installed on the site but inactive. To add a new plugin, go to Add New. And then you can see Featured Plugins, Popular Plugins, Recommended and Favourite Plugins. Alternatively, you can upload a plugin. That may be useful if you've purchased a plugin rather than getting one for free from the WordPress plugin directory. Or you can go straight to the WordPress plugin directory at wordpress.org slash plugins. But for now, let's go to the Recommended section. And we're going to install an SEO, a search engine optimization plugin called Yoast. So let's go to install now. And the plugin has been successfully installed, so let's activate it. And then depending on the plugin, you may see a, a quick tour or some help files to help you get started. This particular one comes with the tour, which we'll leave for now and close. And then if you look on your navigation menu, most plugins will give you a new item on that menu. And that's where you'll control your plugin from. And these menus will vary depending on the plugin that you've got. If at any point you want to inactivate the plugin or you want to completely remove it, then if you go to plugins and install plugins, you'll find it in the list and you can deactivate it. And once you've deactivated, you can delete it.